hi all welcome to another video session today I'm gonna teach you how to do web UI automation with JEP JEP is a groovy language based browser automation tool which uses selenium so let's see how we can start test automation with JEP so it's better as QA professionals automation professionals learn multiple tools and multiple scripting languages so let's see how we can do groovy automation so first of all I want you all to go and read on go to www.jpc.org which gives you information about groovy and how we can script it to Groovy uh, which gives you information about JEP and how we can automate through Groovy language so you know JEP supports Firefox IE, Chrome, Safari and these are still on experiment levels so you can just glance through it and see how the scripting has been done so let's move on to our tutorial session so you have to have Eclipse and have a specific you know for each and every language and tool a separate workspace it will keep your code and everything projects tidy go to marketplace and type Groovy and hit enter and you can it will search you and say Groovy development tool so you have to install this to start on JEP now what you have to do is you have to go and create a new Groovy project here it is so create a new Groovy project give a name and click finish now what you have to do is you have to go to the project and you have to have the Groovy support added to it so create a new project can say JEP 2 so it creates a JEP project what you have to do is you have to have the perspective of this you have to have the Maven perspective installed so you can have convert go to configure convert to Maven project okay so if you say let it finish now it creates a palm so it's it's Maven based project look at it so I have created all. Uh, uh, I have already created a Groovy Maven project. So my palm. I add this palm dependencies. Okay. So the palm dependencies are this. You have to have Jebish, Jebish core, Jeb core dependency 2.1 I'm using and also selenium selenium comb driver that is the latest 3.11.0 and selenium HQ selenium support 3.6.0 you can have 3.11.0 the latest one and this maven compiler plugin so these I will be listing in YouTube as a comment so you can use them so what we had to do is next we create a go to the source and create a default package which has test.groovy a file we go to source create a new file called any name test 3.groovy so it's a groovy script that I'm writing then once the maven dependence are there you can say import jeb.browser then define in the object instantiate the object from uh, the browser class then just type browser.go and you will go to the google.lk page now I'm going to do a search simple search of selenium so this is uh, the ID you can have it at hash and you can have also class that is the CSS path of objects so I'm just clicking it and 
then I'm clicking the link and I'm verifying the title so it's very simple assert will help you to verify the title the browser title so it's very simple so you run as Ruby script so the browser comes up runs the chrome driver you should have the chrome driver latest installed if you have the latest chrome browser type selenium then goes to the selenium site and verifies it so this is how we do jeb we start kick start on automation on jeb which is groovy based browser ui automation tool using selenium so i hope you like this video and start automating with jeb if you like this video please put a like on the linkedin post thank you